Hello everyone, B-Phone 4 and Son of Beast here, and this time, it's about to go down. We are now in the conference finals for the championship game in between the Eastern and Western Conference. Now, this is where it gets things interested. If you're ready, it's that time, folks. One of the teams will be heading into the finals and win the whole thing. One team for Western Conference and one team for the Eastern Conference. It's coming up next, after this. Let's bring it on. It's what it all comes down to. LeBron James is one of the greatest men if you're playing with the player of the Cavaliers. But his team, he now refuses to quit. He never really wants to give up. But now, his team really needs him for the Lakers. Yeah, they all say contracts are everywhere. But this was never been the fella that he ever won the finals since 2016 with the Cavaliers. But this all has to happen. Every other time, they give him what he wanted. Well, LeBron James, a definite word to make that one helpful, a moment. They really loved him. It's fantastic in the first half today. He got him off to a great start, and even with that, we were only down three at the half. Um, I think it's been the timely shots by their role players. Um, obviously, the, I think the KCP, the Michael Porter Jr., the Bruce Browns, um, even Jeff, you know, hit a, a big-time timely shot today, you know, when we were kind of going on a run. So um, I, I think it's been their supporting cast have kind of uh, made those timely shots um, that's, uh, you know, allow them to kind of have the edge. We'll be here all night. Two yeah. on one for the Nuggets. Brown, Caldwell, Polk with the lefty layup. You just get him open, you just get, get him the ball and get him open. Uh, and, and see, I think it's so cool to see when, when he, when, uh, he gets, when everybody's like, you just get him the ball and screen for him, do something, just make them make some kind of little mistake so he can go and work. It's always a rematchable. From Nuggets and Lakers, they've always been a tough team, but they never get around easily to make that win. The ultimate matchup in between Nikola Jokic and LeBron James, it's always tough. But no one may never know if there is a higher range than that. Western Conference Finals against the Lakers back in 09 as Jokic throws it up and in. Just his fifth field goal attempt. Murray fires away at three. It's good. Jamal Murray struggling all night, making some big buckets here in the fourth. Joker working from the nail. Tough fadeaway. Counted and won. Oh, the joke's on you, Los Angeles! I mean, I never, I never, I never doubted, doubted my team, and um, I know they're capable. You see, in the in in third, third quarter, KCP had a huge, huge one segment, like four minutes. Away. He had, a, he had a big box out on AD. He had a turn, he had a, a steal. He had a big three, two big threes, or one big three. So I mean, you know. We have some really good, really good players that can can step up in, in the right moment, and, and that's what we did. Lakers, Nuggets, next on 2K Sports. Hello everyone, Son of Beast here. Welcome to another Western Conference Finals. As right now, this is part of the Game 3, as we're about to be seeing this part of the next matchup. As I just said here before, this is what happens already, because Denver have already won two games in a row and mile high. But now, as you already know, the Avalanche have already won against the Kraken. They definitely had that one tied up too. But it looks like the, the Lakers might need some little answer back. They're starting to go a little downward right there because they're looking for a win to try to keep them up. Their ways of his score is very untouchable. But there's no way that they're trying to find out if the real game was really a push out. But it didn't really seem like it, anybody is trying to keep it over the range of the system. They're trying to get over this and try to win it again. But right now, the Lakers needs to find a way to make an answer back. Will they win the third? Or will the Nuggets extend the lead to a 3-0 lead score? And be, before we head in back to Cleveland for the next part of the game to keep your eyes on. Well, there might be one word, but there may not be anybody that could be finding out with another matchup. Right now, standing by, I will have is Kevin Arlen, along with Craig Anthony and Brett Barry. And, standing by, I will be 
reporting here for after the halftime, for the halftime show and post game show. That means it'll be me phone that'll be here with us. Hey, thanks for joining with me. I really appreciate it to everyone else. And we'll see you all later after the first half and second half. See you all soon and let's get the game started for the Western Conference Finals of Game 3. Let's do it, team. 2K Sports, welcome to the following presentation of the Western Conference Finals. Over minute 30 into this first quarter. 
outside Russell. Pass for Reed. Back to Russell. Kicks it out to LeBron. LeBron to Jay. Set up LeBron. I mean, running offense for the key normally works out pretty good for you. This is important. Back to Murray. Over Russell. And it's set back.
26. Shots from free throw range. He is six full time on the yeah. answer to my round. I like the fact that Smith is a very solid shooter from mid range. His teammates are confident with him from that spot. Pass to Hachimura. Rebound by the Nuggets. Their last game, a win against the Lakers, looking to carry it into this one. And I was really impressed with that passion to win. I mean, I don't think anybody saw that coming. They just scored back there in that third quarter. The Lakers have gone far to shoot the ball here in the first quarter. To the inside, Beasley. Good work defensively by Smith. And for in the lead. On the way, Bryant. Covered by Bamba. Brown outside. There's Green with the three. And Bamba pulls it down. The Lakers shoot 36% in this first quarter. Trying to get their hair to the middle. Sure, the pass to Jay. Angeles leading by three. 
Aaron Russell. He just could not put it together in that loss to Denver. Shoots the three. Three. Austin. Three. Right out there. Get this for better or worse, it looks like the lap. Those three And you're looking over before because of whatever player in inbounding, this was a very like a tough one. And you know that the Lakers have already been trying to like reach him out of it. Just because they were really good doesn't mean that they really don't quit. They really just really want to make that one quick and easy. They really up to a fun, but they won't be stopping here until we leave it alone. Yeah, there might be there might be one more that we can try to like help them out. And that is the key to succeed. Now back to Kevin Hart. And so it's Jokic with the ball. He brings it up for the Denver Nuggets. Six point game. Not going to go that time. So long. So he's lost the two with the other one. He's in with Kyle Carter by four. No good from Diesel. I love the anticipation defensively there to get it to the perfect spot. Let's get back into this one and finish it off 
for the win. For the lead to take. to fix that target a little bit more to try to keep it going. But, but Mike, Mike Malone is trying to make a reaction out of it. They can't really just believe it to start like this. They don't want it to get to leave him out like that. Like there's an open range out in, in the slot. They really are getting tired. Good on the second free throw. The Nuggets trail by 11. Sixteen left in the second quarter. Brown outside. There's Green with the three. He on the Lakers. Green just got his fourth one down in this one. Here's Russell. The end of Russell. Russell's got the lead. Okay, Laura James. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn around. We see Brown get to get some momentum. Yeah, yeah. 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 Welcome back to another two NBA 2K Sports Halftime Show. As right now, me and Mifon are about to take a look. Lakers are on a blowout start for the first half of the game. Sometimes Denver Nuggets are trying to keep them back right towards the, toward the line, and it may not be possible enough to find someone else. Let's start with you, Mifon, for the Lakers. 
Oh, they're starting to get over this one. A lot of power forwarding on the drive. They really wanted to make that one clear ball. They wanted to stop them for the fourth seat, and they needed to get this one right away. Now for you, Santa Beast for Denver Nuggets. Well, the Denver Nuggets are really turning out that great, but they were not really turning out like they were going to finish the first quarter before the second quarter. It's not really that difficult that they don't want to get it done, but they can't let it happen, they can't let it fall down. That's what they got to do to try to keep it in bounds. And that's a wrap. For a halftime show, time to send you back down to Kevin Arlen and the crew, along with Kel Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. See you all later for the post game show. What can you say, LeBron James? What an impressive effort today. And how about the amount he's contributing in the scoring column through two quarters? He has been terrific. And you know what? They've come at him a few different ways defensively, and nothing has slowed him down. And as we dive into the second half, we'll find out if the next two quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it has been a runaway. Second half is underway. Here's who Michael Malone's got on the floor. Gordon steps in at the four with Jokic in at center. Murray and Caldwell Pope, the guards. And it's Gordon at the three. And the foul. Walking ball on the Thunder Nuggets. Jamal Murray. His first personal foul. First team foul. Just didn't get there quick enough. Yeah, he was one step late that time. Getting another opportunity here to see that powerful rejection. Boy, did he get up quick to reject that shot. That's as fundamental as defense gets. On defense, then. Oh, of an actual game. Well, when you know it, you got to show it. You've got to love strong defense, especially when it comes in the form of harsh rejection. Wow. And in a block like that, sends a message. Nikola Jokic. We're not giving up this lead. Hey, even by NBA standards, Jokic is a mountain of a man. 6'11", they list him at 284. That's almost a seventh of a ton, folks. The Joker can handle whatever contact he embraces. Here's LeBron following the basket by Jokic. Al Gordon. They count on his contributions, currently providing 16 and a half points a game. Murray dishes to Gordon. Three pointer. And James pulls it down. Lakers lead by 15. Russell from long range. It's all in by Michael Porter. Porter's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. All well poked. Kicks to Jokic. Right on the puck. Big ol' Jokic. Three Jokic. This is his fault. Well. He's enjoyed the kind of day you expect in terms of well poked. He can bring them right back into this game. Andrew finds James. Here's Davis. And it's Jokic with the rebound. Jokic has got six rebounds now in the game. Michael Porter. This is from Jamal Murray. team he's been on. This is a superstar player. No question about that. He can headline a roster full of superstars. Not Time much. out. Los Angeles. He can't do it. So the Lakers call timeout their first. Last season, of course, Marcus Smart won the Defensive Player of the Year. You know, Greg, it's rare to see a confident should your players get more over consideration from this point on. It's tough. Yeah, I, I do think they should. I think that the numbers, though, tend to favor the rim protectors, but it's only right to recognize great events at every position, especially in May. Now, I tell you this one here, the third defenseman I was usually going for because of Anthony Davis, how well he was blocking it. You know, it wasn't that really that clear, but you can definitely spot it on because he was already been making that one a huge blocking chain. They were really that good in the strong defenseman run, but it seems like that the Denver Nuggets are really like climbing their way in. 
Yeah, yeah, it looks like they are because they're trying to like make that one connection with a stronger feed. And because you can't just really tell what's important to you. You want to make sure you have that one at the right moment. Keep an eye on them because they're very off to a rangeable run. We don't want that one to get in the way because they are really that tough. And it's tough for them to try to stay alive. And the night is losing changes. Three is checked in for Gordon. And Reggie Jackson is up in for Murray. And we're just around two minutes into the final half of play now. Davis, the pass to Schroeder. Nice ball from the end on the left. And Davis can't get it to go. Only 20% from the field to start this half. To me, it looks like their opponent may have made some nice adjustments. Shot by Cole Oh, no good. Los Angeles leading by 11. LeBron dishes to Schroeder. Loads it up for Davis. Putting up the points on a very steady basis, averaging around 17 and a half points a game. And here's James opening up for the Lakers. Going inside. James! It never gets old seeing LeBron throw it down, especially when he decides to do it with a little flavor. And the Davies Marwell Boat. This throw. And he jacks it. The ball in tight and fit. There's the pass to LeBron. And here is Hatchie Shot clock at six. Terrific. Schroeder. Fight all around. You know, give Schroeder credit. Taking the contact with a command and staying in control. And the latest now from our side of the reporter, David Aldrich. David Hit the law of Jokic. Jokic just got six. He says, from Michael Porgy. Jokic very impressive. Good at rolling to the right spot after setting the screen and doing it quickly. He picks to James. Pass to Beasley. This one for three. Rebound by the Nuggets. And the well is running dry for him right now. And, you know, you can sense his frustration. This is going to be a test of his resolve here. Here's James. Here's Davis. Ebony. Davis. He's seven for nine. Timeout, Denver Nuggets. They have been a breaking ball. Money, it's not just the only way to give your one to give that one to win. But in the major credit, you are always going to give that one right. <laughs> I wouldn't say if I were you, because if it, if it does happen now, they were giving it up to point. Well, you got it all coming out out there. They're really effective on that one. They're giving it good runs. Lakers never won in game three, but they really wanted that back. Los Angeles making a switch here. Bombas checked in. 
big group substitution here for Denver. And Ryan is checked in for Green. Aaron Gordon comes in for Porter. Brown is checked in for Contavious Caldwell Pope. And Smith subbed in for Jackson. Now here's Bryant. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. But he gets with another miss. Los Angeles leading by 15. LeBron, that's a two-pointer. LeBron, J. Ooh. 14 points on LeBron. I love this shot. Zero. When he sets the bar for the rest of the team. Brown outside. Back to Jokic. Nikola Jokic. Yes, sir. Who's Brown? Who's team. They love to see the big guys scoring like this. The Lakers have gone in a pretty good shooting pace at 6 of 13 from the field here in the third. Now 8 seconds separate the two clocks. And when... Hachimura against Bryant. And that one's good. Three. Hachimura. He's got his first two points of the night. We're coming down to the end of the of the game three, but there's one more quarter left. Well, they're all inbounding. All eyes on Anthony Davis. We'll be right back after this. And let's take this opportunity now to show you our State Farm assist of the game. And I'm glad this was the pick because I love this pass. Such a great dish. That's what I call court vision. Yeah, and with the accuracy to go along with that vision. I mean, he put the ball in the absolute perfect spot. That's how you orchestrate. And there may not be a lot of drama down the stretch as we head into the fourth quarter, but stranger things have happened. Jared Vanderbilt out there with Muhammad Bamba. Then it's Rui Hachimura. And there's D'Angelo Russell. And it's Reeves in at the shooting guard position. That's who's in the game for the Lakers. Murray for three. A shot straight Ball from Murray. the Murray. For three. Brown's got four assists now tonight. He's uh, more so confident in his game. Murray doesn't think twice about pulling the trigger from deep. Nor should he. Here's Reeves. And with the lead, I like the strategy here. Continue to get the ball to guys who can do something with it. If it's working, keep working. That's what I say. Keep the pressure on. Raji passes the corner. And he gets the spot. Number two, Joe Vanderbilt. It's first personal foul. First team foul. He's a hard guy to keep in front of. At the line, for Denver. Aaron Gordon. For the Los Angeles Lakers, number three, Anthony Davis. Davis is checked in for Bamba, and a switcher also for Denver. Porter is checked in for Bryant. No good on the second free throw. Los Angeles leading by 16. So with the three, it's all in by Brock. You know what, they're winning though, despite the fact that he has just been really off. In the corner, Murray with it. Good work Jamal there. Murray. You know, when Murray finishes like this, guys, it shows you how aggressive his mindset is in attacking the defense. And that was another look at the fantastic mobile one drive that happened a moment ago. And even down big, the effort and energy 
still there to try and make the combo. Now here is Hatchimer. Passes it to Reeves. Denver foul. Number 50, Aaron Gordon. His most four stolen foul. Aaron Gordon. First team foul. At the line for the Lakers. Austin Reeves. Two shots. Checked in for Denver. Contadius Caldwell Pope comes in for Bruce Brown. That's also good. So he hits both backwards. We're just over a minute and a half now in the fourth. Murray dishes the fourth. Back to Murray. It's stolen by Davis. Catching her on with it. Now guarded by the fourth. And with the far as Lakers got to score in some time, the fourth team is the first personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for the Lakers. Murray Archimura. At the line for two shots. The first free throw is good. I have to keep an eye here for Michael Porter Jr. This one is a very tough call. They're saying that that this was very that tough. Now most of it in balancing is very that difficulty. But don't keep being in touch with that one. Mario Gachimura maybe they may have it all. And if he does it, he makes it a win. Gachimura hits them both. Impeccable from the line since halftime. No misses yet. You can't do much better than that, guys. Porter kicks to call well Pope. A three-pointer off the mark. Conference Finals on 2K Sports is brought to you by American Express. Don't live life without it. Your logo, Kia Dealers. A moment that inspires. And by Mountain Dew. Do the do. Nuggets trail by 20. Murray, the pass to Gordon. Russell against Murray. That one, no good. Nice team from Russell. He is just really an almost playing for the other team. The shooting has just been poor. Hachimura picks to Russell. Vanderbilt, the pass to Hachimura. And Denver Kyle, number one, Michael Porter Jr. Is a second personal foul. The routine foul. Is with the media. Is that line for the Lakers. Three. Not Chief Morrow. In two shots. You're on 
TV. You got to keep it together. However, I think that as a society, we're a little more tolerant of certain words that are used in public. He misses the free throw. He looks like a two shirt for Denver. For Green. Number 15, Nikola Jokic. He's good on the second. For those just joining us, fourth quarter here, we're just over two and a half minutes into it. Now, here's Jokic. Kicks it to Porter. Outside Gordon. Denver passing it around. Porter, no luck. It's a plus five. Defended by Gordon. Hey, Hachi Mora. From Jared Vanderbilt. Hachi Mora, leaving no doubt about that one. And so it's Jokic with it. He brings it up for the Denver Nuggets. The Clark one step for the Nuggets. Pass consistent. Jared Vanderbilt. Second game after game, Kevin. He is eager to get back to the top. The line, Jokic. Good job. Are won and lost on the boards, and he wants to be able to contribute in that way. But he is a brilliant, brilliant player, not just a rebound. Well, he's a little bit too tough on that one because Jared Vanderbilt had already fouled. He had three more fouls to give. Free throw, good. Jokic. New and substitution for the Lakers. Number six, moves to a Ron James. Experience. Load management could hurt revenues even further. Yeah, you know, when more fans can pay to watch individual games, it's a bit of a, an a la carte system. Um, I think you need that star power every night. And even beyond that, Kevin, I think players, all players, but particularly the star players, have a responsibility to try to show up for work every single night. And that really should be the mindset. I think it goes beyond revenue. Anthony Davis from LeBron James. Every time you have to understand rest, but I think rest should probably be confined to practice. Michael Porter Jr. Number three. Or the coaching staff. Rob Nikola Jokic. Jr. takes these kinds of shots. It really helps establish a rhythm for him. The pass to Reeves. Here's James. And that's Jokic with the rebound. Jokic Two minutes remaining in the fourth quarter period. Two minutes. This is the fourth. Now here's Pogo Pope. He's covered closely. And again, again, Jokic. Nikola Jokic. He's 7 of 10 from the field. Jokic never lacking in terms of getting his body involved, throwing his body around, using that bulk and power to grab rebound. Here's Reeves. James, the pass to Vanderbilt. Down low, out to Russell. Over Jokic. And it's Russell missing. The Nuggets trail by 18. And, you know, this will be a big victory for them. They came out and executed their game plan, and what a huge win for the Lakers. This was a very efficient offense tonight. And the, they found a way to get their shots to go down. A little luck didn't hurt. A lot of their 50-50 shots fell their way. And this will now push it to a total of 44 games in the win column on the season. And what a tremendous standout performance it was for Davis. Well, the defense just couldn't figure him out, and he continued to put it to him. Now, here is Russell. Austin Reeves. They made the most Russell, Russell they six. comfortable and locked in throughout the night. Boy, they've given their fans plenty to cheer about, that's for sure. Effort, skill, coaching. Nicola, your They've done it. 
Coming off a big game, his confidence couldn't be higher, and Coach knows it. Showing no signs of slowing or cooling down. Anthony Davis. He won't hurt your muscle. Your best when it matters most. And you know, once they got victory in their view, a huge injection of energy and a great run to finish it off. About three seconds between shot and game clock. Pass to Reeves. It doesn't go for him. Oh, well, Pope with some nice D. Murray with it. Passes it to Jokic. That's the end of the period. Your final score, Los Angeles Lakers, 65. And Denver Nuggets, 45. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks very much, AD. Efficient night offensively. What got you going there? Great job, thanks so much. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Clark Kellogg, Greg Anthony, and David Oldham, this is Kevin Harlan, along with our terrific 2K Sports crew, thanking you for tuning in. See you later. All right, Kevin, thank you very much. As right now, this all has to come down with two wins, one for Cleveland Cavaliers and one for Los Angeles Lakers. Because of right now, there is a lot of switchback in between. Yeah, I know. This is very that tough. We know that the Cleveland Cavaliers haven't won that game. But you know, this was definitely tough, tough enough, though, to keep an eye on that one. But hopefully, they'll try to keep it up here more than we know about before. Here's how they did with the total statistics of the game. 53, 33%, and 80%, along with fast break points, 17, and points in the paint was 38 for the Los Angeles Lakers. They are already on a streaking run. They just really wanted to make that one a tough one. They wanted to show who's the boss. And because of that point, they never really wanted to get it through. Well, don't have to choose me. I'm not in it. I don't even pay respect on that one. Six uh, points for a second chance for Denver Nuggets. 11 bench points with assisted for 23 for Los Angeles Lakers. Six offensive rebounds was even. Then defensive rebounds was 27 for the Los Angeles Lakers. Four steals, five blocks. That is a crazy look. Just seven points off for Los Angeles, and team fouls were four. Eleven dunks were performed. That's a lot. And the biggest lead was 23 for Los Angeles Lakers. And their time possession for Denver was 12 minutes. That was all that happened. No question that was asked. Well, I guess that really does have to end up with this part of Game 3. Well, it did really turn out very well. Now let's close it off for three star players of the game. Me phone, why don't you give it a shot? Sure thing. Thank you. So here we are. Number three, we're going to get that one to start off run. And this one goes to one of each. Two for Lakers and one for Nuggets. Austin Reeves. He has 15 points, five rebounds, and three assists. He really did turn out really well by putting up a one three-pointer. Six out of ten field goals were made. It does turn out. He's clearable, and he wanted to make that one a win. And 21 performance wrong along with one dunk. That was crude and amazing how he does. Now for number two. All right, I will give it off to the Joker. It's him. That will be Nikola Jokic. With two assists, 11 rebounds, 19 points, and only one dunk has performed. 24 performance run. Okay, I guess that might be a great run to keep an eye on it. 8 out of 11 field goals we're putting up for Nikola Jokic might be showing up like he did. Anyway, this one has to come down to the biggest block of the game. You know what that is? Yeah, I know. AD. He puts up three blocks in a row. What amazing performance of this skill. And seven dunks. He is on a roll. What a play. And that's number three on the back of a jersey. 
or in front. Two assists, four rebounds, and 20 points. A new official New Balance player of the game. That will be him. Yep, you can definitely just tell him that, that whenever you do for Anthony Davis, you got to give credit to him. If one block, then it was two, and finally, it was three. Just like it did happen, but you don't know whether it's going to be coming in there like that. There it is. That was a amazing, biggest ever in the game. Well, that's it. I guess that's a wrap. Well, as we're being said right now, Beef Phone and Son of Beast are finished for game three. Stay tuned. Tomorrow, tomorrow night will be 7 p.m. back in Cleveland for Rocket Mortgage Fieldhouse. To keep your eyes peeled, as of right now, we'll have the next commentary up. That'll be paintbrush along with the along with ball round pen and a bird contestant of the crew for the commentary, Silver Spoon, and for the Lakers and Nuggets. I will be here along with you. Well, okay, well, it's for it's gonna be definitely for tonight's game. If you all gonna have to a choice, choose me. Well, give it all. Yeah, I respect you. And the third contestant will be OJ. So at that point, I hope that everybody's enjoying your your Pride Month. It is officially officially June. And I really especially thinking that the finals is coming up there very soon. So we might have to find out who will take the win. Well, there's one way that we might need to know this before we're going to give this one a good call and a comeback. It might be a one way to get it done. So that's it. Thanks for watching, everyone. And peace out, everyone, for a while as the Western Conference Finals of the NBA 2K Sports Style. This is Son of Beast along with Me Phone 4. Have a wonderful evening in Los Angeles. And good night to Mile High. Well, I guess that's going to wrap it up. See you all again for the next part of the game for the pregame show of Cavs and Celtics. And right now we will be heading you to the other side of it, so keep your eyes peeled, especially the next couple games of the Stanley Cup Conference Finals. So stay tuned for that one. Anyways, we're out. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you don't, somebody will. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.